Hello and welcome back to this tutorial. So today I'm showing you how you can use Fusion 360 to make your own enclosures for your DIY MIDI controllers or anything that needs an enclosure. So if you are liking those videos, please give a like and subscribe to the channel if you didn't do yet. So let's get started here. So in the last video, I showed you how you can actually change my own uh, sketches or how you can create your own sketch in order to add mounting holes or add, in order to add any kind of thing here like any kind of hole to your um, to your design so in this video it's going to be the easiest part which is actually how you can uh, export this um, into a file that can be read into a uh, laser cutter right so first thing what you need to do is decide which surface you want to export as a 2D design and you come here and click and you right click and you need to click on create a sketch. I'm not seeing here create a sketch, the, just like edit a sketch because there is there is a sketch here active in the end so if I put my mouse here it thinks that I want to edit this sketch and I don't. So you can just like hide all these sketches. So now you can like right click and create a sketch. And this last sketch here is actually the drawing of everything you have in the panel. So for example, if I hide top and bottom, and now if I hover my mouse through my sketch, you can see all the mounting holes. So let's right click here in this sketch and save as DXF. So DXF is a file that you can or open in your uh, laser cutter or in like Illustrator or in a file in any other software that can actually export to a laser cutter. So let's let's put here like top. Now you need to stop the sketch. Let's see now the bottom. I'm going to I'm going to hide the last sketch. Right click, create sketch. Now I have my sketch here. Export as DXF. Bottom. Let's export the the top panel. So let's stop here. Create sketch. Let's export. And so on. So if we take a look here in our uh, in our files, the uh, have bottom, I have side and top. So if I open this top here, I'm going to open in Adobe Illustrator. And now you can actually export this to whatever software like or to whatever laser cutter you want. So that's one way that you can do uh, your 3D model inside Fusion 360 and then export this to a 2D design. So you can actually see everything that's going on here right in a 3D way. You can see that things fit or if things uh, don't fit right and you can change uh, all the measures, all the design in a parametric way where everything gets adapted once you change one measure, right? And then you can, or you can 3D print this, right? But the, the focus is not that, the focus is using a laser cutter and then you export that. Or if you don't have access to a laser cutter and you want to support the channel, you can order them with me. So I can, uh, print them for you, laser cut them for you, you send me the design, or if you're feeling lazy, I can design this for you too. And in my website, The Nerd Musician, I also have all the things that you might really like, like modules that are going to make your life much, much easier on building your MIDI controller. So trust me, go there and take a look and let me know what you think, okay? Or, so how can you make a dimensional drawing from this file here, right? That's what I'm going to show you in the next video. So 
See you soon.